Sedona's awe-inspiring Red Rock Country is one of the most stunning places on Earth. The essence of geologic time speaks for itself. natural ecosystem is rich with contrast. A moment captured in time will charm generations for years to come. These 800-year-old cliff dwellings were built by the Sanagua, named for the people without water. A land of enchantment owned and cherished by the public. A place for leisure and contemplation. A place for enjoyment and exploration. Local and international visitors alike are attracted to these majestic sandstone formations, scenic vistas, and endless miles of trails. Sedona receives over 4 million visitors annually, and 1.5 million of those visitors recreate on the National Forest. With the area's popularity and 1.5 million pairs of feet come sheer impacts. Demand for recreation in the Southwest has increased over 250% in the last 20 years and Sedona's local economy is now highly reliant on its half billion dollar tourism industry. How do we sustain this marvel of nature from being loved to death? The Red Rock Pass program was introduced in 2000 to help fill the gap. Embracing conservation and engaging visitors to do the same is an immense and courageous undertaking. One of the least understood concepts is why are funds needed and where do they go? 95% Red Rock Pass funds stay local. 30% of funds are used for resource protection, trash cleanup, patrol, and ecosystem restoration. 17% for heritage site protection and interpretation. Seventeen percent visitor information and education. Eight percent trails maintenance. And six percent for wilderness patrol. Highly valued volunteers enhance up to one third of the overall Red Rock program. Since the Red Rock Pass program began, Vandalism has since decreased at sites like Palatki. Several hundred of miles of trail and roads are now being maintained. Thousands of pounds of trash are removed from the forest annually. Popular recreation sites are clean and maintained. And leave no trace education is being shared with over a half million visitors. Success is not measured by dollars generated rather in the preservation of this awe-inspiring place and the joy it brings to all who can experience it. We didn't inherit the earth, we are borrowing it from our children.